Hello everybody on YouTube. If you guys are new to my YouTube channel, if you guys can please subscribe to my page, kindly give the video a thumbs up. Thank you and I really appreciate your guys' love and support. Now, tonight's video is going to be called Medellin, Colombia, six best strip clubs of Medellin. Now, we're going to start from the bottom of the chamber to the top of the chamber, okay? The first club is called El Club de las Conejitas. I mean, I've been there. The club, you know what I mean? It's all right, you know what I mean? Just to go down there, just to witness it for the first time or whatever. You know what I mean? It's not bad for the simple fact that they close there at exactly 4 o'clock in the morning. But if you're going to go there, you know what I mean? I suggest you go in taxi and come in taxi. Okay? For the simple fact that this club is right across the street from El Parque Botero and it's in el centro de medellin so for the most part at that time you know what i mean i suggest you take a taxi okay now another club that i would strongly recommend which is number two okay number two is el club maracaibo el club maracaibo is basically a couple of streets down from el club de las conejitas you know what i mean they call it el ejecutivo the club is nice, you know what I mean? You get you get good bargains there. And um, the girls there are also really, really pretty. And um, trust me, you're gonna be in for a treat if you go to these clubs. Now, another club, which is number three, that I strongly recommend would be Luna Lunera. Right there, you got all kinds of promotions. The girls, they're easy going, they're fun to be with. And the manager of the club is really nice, you know what I mean, he's cool people. And um, he's real funny at that. So if you guys are going out there, trust me, you will not be disappointed if you go to El Club Luna Lunera. Okay? Now, another club that I would strongly recommend that you guys check out. Okay? It is really popular, the same as Luna Lunera, would be El Club Fase 2. Now, Fase Dos is always jumping. There's always something to do there. The girls there are very easy going. They're fun to be with. You got lots and lots of promotions. And um, you're going to be in for a treat for the simple fact that the paisas there are also really, really beautiful. Trust me. They'll go that extra mile to make sure that you're taken care of. You know what I mean? They'll sit down with you. And I just want you guys knowing that if you guys are going to the strip clubs out in Medellin or in Colombia, they're way different from the strip clubs in the States. In the States, you're more limited on what you can do. These girls would, I mean, straight out, you know what I mean, pop, a, pop their titty inside your mouth, you know what I mean, and, and just go that extra mile, you know what I mean? And, and you don't get me wrong, you see some of that in the States, but you see more of that in Colombia and, and other parts, you know what I mean? And it's just something else. Like me personally, I like going out there from time to time to these strip clubs just to kind of, you know what I mean, leave the routine, you know what I mean? And some of these females, you know what I mean, they're really fun to be with, you know what I mean? Once you become friends, you know what I mean, it's just different, you know what I mean? But if you're going out there trying to make those girls into your, your girlfriend, leave it at that. Don't even push it. Don't even push it. But Fase those, I strongly recommend it. Strongly recommend it. Now, another club that is a really, really good club, but you have to make an appointment with them ahead of time, from what I've heard, is La Mansión. La Mansión is it's one of its top of a line. You know what I mean? It's top of a line. And um, that one's number five. This club is number five. This one is one of the ones that are on top of its list. Okay, so if you're going there, you're going to run into really, really beautiful girls. And for the most part, every club that I mentioned, you're going to run into beautiful girls. But just some clubs, you know what I mean, have better looking girls than others. You know what I mean? And um, right here, they deal with people with money. So, you know what I mean? I just want you guys to keep that in mind. Okay. Now, last but not least, everyone has been waiting for this one. Number six. Okay, number six is called Las Islas. Okay, this one club is on the other side 
where el, 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 el mirador de las palmas is at, it's on that side. But um, the girls that you're going to see here are something else, okay? They're really beautiful, but um, if you are wanting to be with them on a one-on-one -on -one, on sexual experience, it's a little bit more expensive, but you're getting what you pay for. You're getting what you pay for. A lot of guys that go to Las Islas, they come out falling in love. You know what I mean? <laughs> but yeah, man, honestly, the truth, man. Like, when I went to Las Islas, I was blown away. I was truly blown away for the simple fact that you run into really, really extravagant type of females. You know what I mean? And um, it would be nice if they had some of those girls down there, you know what I mean, in El Centro and stuff like that. But, hey, I mean, I understand. I get it, you know what I mean? But, yeah, if, if you guys are going to Las Islas, I would suggest that, you know what I mean, you take a good amount of money for the simple fact that, you know what I mean, it's a little bit more expensive. But you are paying what you're getting for what you're getting. And trust me, you're going to have a beautiful night. You're going to enjoy the music. The strippers there are amazing. The paisa women are to die for. So if you guys are wanting to go out there and really, really hit one of the top clubs in the city of Medellin, say no more. Las Islas is waiting for American tourists and from tourists from different parts of the world to go down there and just hit the block in full effect and enjoy, you know what I mean, the scenery and, you know what I mean, just enjoy life, you know what I mean? Life is just one, and we have to live it to the fullest. So, if you guys have any questions, any suggestions, please make sure to leave some comments on the bottom below, and I will get back to you as soon as possible. If you guys like this video, please make sure to give the video a thumbs up, and please make sure to subscribe to my page, and stay tuned for more content. Good night. Bye-bye, everyone. Bye-bye.